everyone. Today is day 28 of the Australian Brumby Challenge. Cooper was really good with Kentucky Equine Research yesterday. He walked on the scales exactly as planned. Today, he's going to be wearing a saddle blanket under his roller for the very first time. I am still going to introduce the blanket with inside bend. That way, if Cooper does get a fright, he can feel free to move away from me and not jump on top of me, away from the blanket. Inside bend's really important. We've been working on that since day one. This is the first time Cooper's seen his blanket. It's a very pretty blanket. that Cooper has had his roller and saddle blanket on at the same time. What do you think? Good idea? Usually I have all of Cooper's gear ready, but today we're going to come into the tack room. Come on, they're my boots. No, they're my boots, come on because I forgot to get his bridle ready. Sorted. You gotta go round the door. You've got a girth on. Good boy. Today is only the second day that Cooper's ever worn a bridle. So we're not going to connect anything to it. It's just going to be the bit and the bridle. So here we flex towards the bridle. Cooper did that all by himself, which was kind of cool. Flex towards the bridle. Thank you. One hand between his ears. Now we've got him. Flex. Head down a little bit. Good. And can you open your mouth? Can you? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Cooper. Good. My mum was watching my videos the other day and she's like, how does Cooper know how to go sideways when you do this? And I said, that's really amazing because I wonder if most people think that. That's the cue. That's not really the cue. <laughs> it's, but it makes sense, doesn't it? Like if that's the, what you're watching on the videos. so. It's not that I'm crossing my legs that make Cooper sidestep, it's that I'm lifting my energy and looking at the girth and I'm asking him to go sideways with my motivator, good. And when he does one or two steps, he gets released. Can I cross your legs? Ah. Uh -huh, but he doesn't go sideways. So here I need to ask Cooper to move his hip but he's a bit focused on the bit in his mouth and not listening to the cue, so I did need to motivate there a little bit more. There's a nice little side step. Good horse, move to here. And he can have a big pat and release. 